In the previous video, we have seen the network elements and the source of energies. Now, I'll see resistance. When a current flows in a material, the free electrons move through the material and collides with other atoms. These collisions causes the electrons to lose some of their energy. This loss of energy per unit charge is the drop in the potential across the material. The amount of energy lost by an electron is related to the physical property of the material. These collisions restricts the movement of electrons. The movement of electrons is nothing but the current. The inherent property of the material to restrict the flow of electrons is called resistance and it is denoted by the letter R and the units are ohms. The symbol two terminal elements so we have terminals two you see A and B this is R. One ohm is defined as the resistance offered by the material when the current of one amp flows between the two terminals with one volt applied across it. According to the Ohm's law, the current I is directly proportional to voltage V and the I is inversely proportional to 1 by R. Then I equals to V by R. For small values of currents and voltages, I small i equals to small v by, v by r. So if we write this equation in terms of charges, then V equals to r dq by dt or i equals to, we can write this, small v by air cloth or g v, where g is the conductivity of the conductor. and the units are moles or inverse of ohms. When the current flows through any resistive material, heat is generated by the collisions of the electrons with other atomic particles. The power absorbed by the resistor is converted to heat. The, the power absorbed by the resistance P is given by V i that equals to V is I r i we can write this i square r where i is the current in the resistance in amps and v is the voltage across the resistor in volts then energy lost in the resistor in time t is given by w equals to integral 0 to t p dt that equals to pt that equals to p is nothing but i square or t or this you can write v square by r into t this is the power equation and this is our energy lost and this is our connectivity